You gotta cure him. Because why wouldn't you have a cure him, right? Well, it's a very good thing we got Kratos the legendary killer. Wow, that thing is so... <gasps> no, 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 no! Why does this game hate me? What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Terrible Tavi, back at again with episode number nine of our Pokemon Y Randomizer Nuzlocke. Welcome back on in to everybody who doesn't know who I am. My name's Terrible Tavi. Thank you so much for checking out the video. And uh, yeah, this is episode nine of our Randomizer Nuzlocke. If you've not checked out the rest of the videos, make sure you click that button right above my head. Uh, but let's go ahead and just jump right into things here. So if you guys do recall from the last episode, um, yeah, yeah, um, our team might have taken a bit of a harder blow than I wanted it to. Knowing that there are random evolutions in this game, though, I'm very interested to see what these Pokemon will be when they're fully evolved. So what I'm going to do real quick is going to grind these Pokemon up, go ahead and get them to their next stage of evolution and see exactly who we can add to our squad here. So let's get it. All right, so little Nikki's finally evolving here. Did a little bit of grinding on this. Only took one level. So let's see what our little vampy, little Nikki's gonna evolve into. Please be something good. Please be something good. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Stop teasing me. What are you gonna be? Bruh. Another Pokemon that can evolve. Oh, buddy. And of course, Tortuga doesn't evolve until level 37. I just looked it up. I had to know. I was like, I wasn't sure because I know some fossil Pokemon don't evolve until later on. Like I know the original Kabutops line, uh, th th they don't evolve until like level 40, level 42 and things like that. That thing evolves at level 37. So it's going to be a minute. I'll be right back with you guys. <laughs> All right. We level up Tina one more time. Let's see what Tina's gonna evolve into. Hopefully something lit. Come on, please show me something good. Show me something good, Tina. Please, please, Tina. Please, Tina. Come on. What are you gonna be? What are you gonna be? Yes, yes, come on. Why do I keep getting things that can't evolve? Why? You are a very large man. What are you doing here? I'm gonna act like that didn't just happen. Okay. All right. Well, we made our way back to Lumia City. And now we got to <laughs> this creepy little girl that keeps following us. What do you want? Yes, I defeated the dudes who were in the power plants. I got rid of them, but they got in a bullet bill. <laughs> and King Ty, come on, come on. All right, I'm at the tower. Now what do you want me to do? You want me to go immediately into the gym fight? Is that what you want? Is that is that what they're begging for here? Please, no, no, I, I don't want that kind of shenanigans today. No, 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 get out of my life. Aren't you done yet? Not quite. I just have to check the light circuits here. Oh, Shauna, are you the challenger? Sorry, but you're gonna have to wait a moment. Come on, Clement. All right, everything's ready. The future is ready and everything is active. Well, uh, already. Oh, oh, oh. Yo, I forgot how sick this game is sometimes, and obviously it wasn't supposed to look like that. But we're not gonna worry about it right now. <laughs> That's a Diggersby though. Does anybody else remember how confusing this place was as a kid? Like, I don't know where I'm going right now. Yes, let me go down this back alley. I'm sure it's perfectly safe for me, right guys? Perfectly safe, right? Ah! <laughs> this area is quite a romantic atmosphere, wouldn't you say? No, no. <laughs> Why would I ever say this place has a dreamy? Oh. Okay, Jacob. You should have a croissant. <laughs> what? No, kids, this is why you don't travel down back alleys. You run into folks that have Cresselias. No, excuse you. Get up out of my face. I haven't even healed my Pokemon after training yet. Get out of here. No. All right, setting up the double team, which is uh, not well. Really, this little moon duck has speed boost as well. You don't love to see that. We're gonna shadow sneak it, and of course, why wouldn't you? It's it's this thing's gonna roll on us. We're, it's gonna roll on us. It set up a double team. That's two times speed boost right there. 
It has safeguard up, so we can't land crits anymore. How much damage is this going to do? Not a whole heckin' of a lot. Um, or is... <laughs> Come on, or beam, don't do... Okay, cool, cool. So at least we can live that three times. If this thing has baton pass right now, I'm going to lose my gourd. All right, it's double teaming again. Yeah, mm, stop, please, stop, please, stop, please. Come on, Zabuza, don't break through. No, 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 no. This is, uh... This is not looking fantastic for us right now, folks. What's happening? It's using another orb beam. How much is that going to do to us? All right. All right. Nice. <laughs> All right. Come on, sir. Please do some work here. Ooh, big damage. Big damage. Love it. Love it. Okay. Come on. So we just need to land one more of those and we're a okay. But I'm not okay with this thing having what? Three, four times double team boost right now? Like, come on. Stop that. And we land the hit. Break it through. Zabuza. Let's get it. Yes. Oh. Kids, again, that's why you don't go down back alleys. Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> and he's gone. Okay, then. Um. That wasn't sus at all. This town is way too confusing. There's too many coffee shops. Who needs this much coffee in their life? Honestly, me. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> I'm in danger. What's back here? Oh, there's nothing back here? All right, we're good. We're living it. It's fine. I don't need to be back here. Ah, wall, get out of here. Umios Museum. This place sounds interesting. It costs money to get in here. Oh. Oh. Okay, fine. Would I like to enter? Sure. Nah, I'm good. Oh my goodness, look, there's Pico! I miss Pico so much. You're a wizard, Harry. I like how this photo is actually a real life like painting here that just has Mew photoshopped into it. Game Freak was on something else when they made this game. Well, that was complete and utter waste of my time. You look interesting. Talk to me. What about espers up your sleeves? Why would you put espers up your sleeves? Are you a magician? I just want to point out that there, there's a whole tale speeding monorail train right here. And people theorize that Sword and Shield was going to connect to Kalos. Yeah, here's your train for that right here, folks. That, that's such a missed opportunity. Game Freak, come on now. Why? Why? Why you do it to us like that? Why you do us dirty? Now, somebody told me that I can get another encounter right over here. Yes, Amberette Town. Let's go. Shout outs to you. Shout outs to you in the comment section for uh, letting me know about this one right, 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 real quick. That I can get an encounter over here for Amberette Town. So let me go ahead and swipe my, my my encounter up and see exactly what else we can get for the team because, uh, you know, the, the power on the PC is not looking too powerful at the moment. And we are just fishing. Ooh, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Yo, a Golet? Okay, okay. I am a-okay with a Golet on the sky. Whoa, let me go ahead and pick this baddie up real quick. Like, I love me some Golet now. Like, okay, so here's the sad thing about this encounter is I know for a fact when Golet evolves, we're not going to get ourselves a... <laughs> we're not going to get ourselves a Golurk, but, but, Golurk on the team? Not too bad, not too shabby. I ain't too mad about it. It's good type coverage. It's ground with the uh, ground and ghost. So, you know, overall, I feel like this could be a very powerful Pokemon. We just got to see exactly what it evolves into, even though, you know, it evolves at level 42. Brobot, welcome to the terrible Tavi crew. Welcome on in, Brobot. Let's go. Let's go. All right, finally. After what? Two evolutions already? This will be our third evolution for Little Nicky now? My lord, my lord. What are you going to evolve to be, Little Nicky? Come on, tell me. Keep, you're keeping me in suspense. What is your fully evolved evolution line looking like here? Come on, give it to me. Give it to me. It's, 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 oh! All right. Little Nicky is evolving again. Scatterbug. Please <laughs> don't be anything worse than a scatterbug. Give me something good. I've been waiting. I've been patient. I've been leveling. Come on. What do we get for everything? Eswana. Eswana. I don't need a swan. <laughs> Not only do I have a swana, but I have a swana that knows drought. So all of its super effective water moves will be weakened. God, this Pokemon is trash. I just can't. 
I just can't. Uh, all I could do here is laugh at the fact that we evolved this thing 15 bajillion times to get a swana. I'm going to have an aneurysm. All right. I got a new strategy here. You see me healing up my Pokemon. What I'm about to do is I'm about to do some hardcore grinding. I got some Pokemon out of the box. And uh, yeah, we're going to see what type of evolutions we can get here for a variety of different Pokemon. So I'll keep you updated who's doing the evolving and what they evolve into and see what we're actually going to use for our team moving forward. So stay tuned. <laughs> All right, guys, you remember Angry Burbs. So anybody who's stuck around since the beginning of the Nuzlocke, you guys remember who Angry Bird is. Angry Bird is about to evolve here. Maybe I should have kept on the squad for a little bit longer. Let's find out here in a second exactly what Angry Burb is going to be. <laughs> of course, it's a slowpoke. Well, guys, why would you be a slow? <laughs> Oh, King Joffrey! <laughs> no. Oh. All right, we're getting a danger to evolve now. Let's see exactly what danger is going to turn into here. Please, danger, be some good. Be some good. What we got? What we got? What we got? Come on. Come on. Please show me big money. No, me, are we? Oh, you know what? I am not mad about having a Snorlax on the squad. Okay. That is something we can take. Now we just need one additional Pokemon. Well, let's go ahead and see exactly what Danger's got going on for itself here. Danger's got weak armor. <laughs> Physical attacks lower the defense, but raises its speed stat, which is very interesting to say the least. I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know how I feel about that. But either way, this thing has toxic spikes, surf, barrier, and acid spray. And uh, its attack stat is uh, quite chunky here. Love to see it. Mm, mm. I don't know. We'll throw it on the squad and see how it does. All right. Hopefully, 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 the final evolution I will be doing this episode before we fight our gym leader fight here. So let's see exactly what this germ is going to be when it evolves. Come on. Give me something good. Give me a legendary, please. Please, legendary. That'd be nice. That'd be nice. Why does this game hate me? And it wants to learn. And it wants to learn torment. Of course, it wants to learn torment because you're tormenting my life. And of course, I don't have a leaf stone. Ichi. All right, guys, finally, the time has come for us to face the Lumios gym leader here. But first, well, you know, we're going to do a quick team recap first because uh, the squad has changed up a little bit. We did a little bit of wind and a little bit of grind. And so I uh, want to reintroduce you to the team real fast. So first off, we got Tree Bear, the pseudo Wudo. You know, the one and only Kratos, the legendary killer itself out of the house. Next up, we got Zabuza, the Greninja, putting in the work, lurking in the shadows and uh, takes its enemies out fast. Next up, we got Cinder rocking uh, Strength, Dragon Rage, Sand Tomb, and Dragon Claw. Still holding that Rocky helmet with Mole Breaker. And next up, we got the shiny Rampardos Reptar. My goodness, this thing is going to put in some very good work in this coming episode. I can already tell. It has Dragon Dance, Fire Fang, Ancient Power, and Avalanche on its moveset right now. And next up, we have Little Nikki the Swana. Yes, Little Nikki the Swana did end up making the final cut for our team. That thing is rocking Poison Jab, Smackdown, Heart Stamp, and Fly. Holding that lefties as well. You know, this thing doesn't have a water move on it, but it's A-OK -okay because this thing also has drought, which uh, wouldn't exactly like the water move set on it to begin with. So, uh, yeah, we're going to rock out with it. Next up, we got Danger the Snorlax with Toxic Spike, Surf, Barrier, and Strength. With that weak armor, not exactly ideal for a Snorlax, but it does have some pretty beefy defense. Maybe we can come in clutch with some extra speed boosting happening. I don't know. We'll see. Also rocking that King Jar because, you know, Danger is the king. Let's get it. Going up the tower. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Gonna answer questions, yeah. Ah, you're that trainer from before. Come straight to battle, haven't you? Well, good. They can call me Bonnie, this gym leader's younger sister. Go ahead and step into the small square. A few steps directly ahead of you, would you? You would have to answer the questions if you want to get farther ahead. Well, maybe I don't want to get further ahead. You ever think about that? <laughs> and I peed at you! <sighs> 
I've been lied to. I just wanted to go busking. Okay. Uh, well, Treebeard is out front, which is a-okay. That Gabuskin is about to get the absolute work knocked into its face. We're going to slide you some rocks real fast. Uh, I heard you were in the market again for a pet rock. You know, we got Tina, we got Jeffrey, we got little Susie up in the corner with the little rocks. So let me show you exactly what we have. Uh, oh, oh, you didn't exactly like what we had in stock, did you? Oh, I'm, uh, well, we got, we got a few of them in the back. I can tell you that much right now. So let me go ahead and grab those out the back. See if my manager will pull them out. Uh, this one right here is my favorite one of all. We call this one Rocky the Rock. Wait, not, not the rock you're, you're looking for? Okay. No, I was right. It's Pikachu, isn't it? It's a Pikachu. Ah! <laughs> All right. What is the next question you have for me, Bonnie? All right. Quiz time. All right. Lay it on me. That's a fletchling. I rock out with these questions because this is what we did on the daily growing up as a kid. Ah, uh, the nostalgia of being a 90s kid. Hmm. Those were the good days, folks, weren't they? Those were the good days. You got to cure them. Because why wouldn't you have a cure them, right? Because why wouldn't you? Well, it's a very good thing we got Kratos, the legendary killer, out for us here. Uh, Kratos, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, some more rocks. Some more rocks. You're going to imprison. Um, what exactly is that going to do? Nothing, because we share no moves in common, Kiram. Uh, but yeah, I heard, again, you were in the market for some pet rocks, right? Right? Oh, you got some pet rocks of your own. I see. Oh, those are some oldies right there, but you know... Every old rock is still a good rock. It's still a little pooper rock to me. I just, that's all I'm saying. Wait. Oh, wait. Is that all the inventory you had? Okay. I'm telling you, it's a fletchling. Lay it on me. Lay it on me. I'm right. I know it. Hey. All right. Third question, folks. What's it going to be? Bunny, give it to me. Third question. I'm great at this. I'll jump up a pen port. It, it, it has uh, lots of lots of frying pans and it likes to pour things in there. Yes, that's the that's the Pokemon right there. That is the Pokemon pan pour. Yes, yes. I'm gonna cry if that's not the right answer. All right, Rico, what you got? You got a little Minion. Light work, little Minion up in here. Tree bird or tree beard? Excuse me. Why did I say bird? Um, you don't exactly want to be out here against a little Minion, so uh, I'm gonna take you out real fast. Probably gonna switch you out for nice and uh. Hmm, who do I want to switch this out for? You know what? I'm going to send out Zabuza, because, uh, why not? Why not? Zabuza's strong enough as it is, right? Maybe I need to get Zabuza out of the team for a little while. I think Zabuza's, uh, yeah, carrying a tad bit. I don't like that. I don't like that it's carrying the team, but, you know, it's the only really thing I got against this Luminion at the moment. It's going to discharge it, probably take it out one hit. Give me easy peasy lemon squeezy. Yep, and you love to see it. Okay, well, light work indeed. All right, I know it's going to be this. I know it's going to be Pampor. Yes. Hey, three for three. You love to see it. All right, how many more questions we got? A fourth question. Oh, my Lord. You got to be kidding me. All right, Bonnie. What's your fourth question? Come on. Come on. Quiz time. All right, come on. That is a scatterbug. Scatterbug. Yes, I know it. It's a scatterbug. Oh, 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 oh. That's, that's another scatterbug. Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. And another scatterbug. Wow. All three of them are scatterbugs? They have to show the image to me twice? Three times? What's happening here? Okay, okay. Which one is... No, there's, they're all scatterbug. What do you mean? I'm pretty sure they're all scatterbug. No, no. You're wrong, Bonnie. You're wrong. That's scatterbugs. Ah, rigged question. Rigged. All right, you got a Pyroar. Ooh. Into the Sante. Choice to be put down first. I wonder if this thing has Intimidate or not. Probably not. Oh, it has Terra Volt. Okay. Um, I see you over there with your... Uh, rocking out with some electric type moves. Is that right? Nope, nope. Everything in this game has fire effect. <laughs> what is happening? We're going to low kick this thing. Just absolutely knock it out. That's complete light work for Kratos over here. But you know what, Kratos? Got to get that aspirance in, right? Got to get all that juicy aspirance. All right, lay it on me, Bonnie. Did you do me dirty? It was a scatterbug number two. I think it was scatterbug number two is the answer. What do you guys think? I knew it. It was scatterbug number two. Get out of my face. All right, guys, just to let you know, before this gym fight begins, we limit ourselves to three healing items, whether that be a full heal or whether that be a hyper podium. We can only use three items of medication here. So because of that, this should be an interesting battle. Oh, thank you again for allowing me to introduce myself. 
This is the gym leader loving us. <laughs> you better watch out for my big brother. He's a gym leader after all. Daddy, how many times do I have to ask you not to tell people about my strengths? I'm really strong, you know, and uh, I don't want I, I want them to underestimate me so they won't actually play to their full potential. <laughs> all right, Clement. I see you with the secret strats over here. Trying to make people think you're not strong when you got a Craig Dilly out front. Okay. Um, well... Not exactly the start I want to see for Reptar here, but I think we'll be okay. We'll find out. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to go ahead and Avalanche here. I don't think uh, Reptar wants to stay out on it, but I kind of want to like poke around, see exactly what kind of moveset it has. It has Amnesia to kick things off. Okay, so it's going to increase its special defense, which is perfectly fine. I'm attacking it for its physical defense here. Avalanche comes out second. What kind of strength? Ooh. Ooh, that does a big chunk right there. Okay. Okay, Reptar, I think you could roll on this thing. It's setting up Ingrain. Not going to do anything for you now. You probably should have set that up out gate, uh, but a bye-bye Cray Dilly. All right. First Pokemon. Super simple, super sweet. Let's get it. Let's get it. What's the next Pokemon you got? You got an Arceus? Because <laughs> why wouldn't you have an Arceus, right? Because why wouldn't you have an Arceus? Okay, so we're going to go ahead and start setting up the Dragon Dance here. It's going to use Gravity, which... I'm defying gravity up in here. You can't bring me down, Arceus, okay? Okay. So, uh, I'm raising my speed up. I'm getting my attack set up. I'm going to use Dragon Dance another time. I'm going to start setting up for the sweep. Because I don't want this Arceus to completely body me here. It's going to use Earth Power. That's super scary for us. That's a ground type move. Okay, not very not very effective. Very interessante and diddly doodly. Okay, so we're going to do Dragon Dance one more time. I'm getting greedy here. But if I can set this up one more time, not take big damage off of this thing, it's using Earth Power again. Okay. Is that going to bring down our special defense? Please don't. Please don't. Okay. We good? We good? Living it? All right. Fine. We're good. We're good to start setting up and sweeping here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a Fire Fang against this thing. Hopefully make it flinch. Come on. If it doesn't knock out, just flinch it. Wow. That thing is so... <gasps> no, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> Arceus had punishment. And I set up Dragon Dance three times. It lived. A Fire Fang. Boosted three times by Reptar. What do I do against this thing? I'm going to send out little Nikki here. Because this thing has Earth Power. I, I just... That's so dumb. Reptar, come on. Come on, dude. What in the world? Okay, we're just going to... We're just going to poison jab this thing. See what we can do against it. Poison jab comes out. We know it's moveset. It's got punishment. It's got earth power. It's got gravity. Oh, this is dumb. This is so dumb. This is so dumb. All right. We're going to poison jab one more time. Hopefully you use a hyper potion. Because why wouldn't you use hyper potion? Arceus. Why do I have to see an Arceus in front of my face right now? Why did you have to take out Reptar? Please. Can we get a poison off on this thing at least? Come on. Can, can, can I see a poison? Uh, I'm going to throw a heart stamp on this thing. See what we can do here with heart stamp. That does nothing. Using gravity again, we're going to take Swan to the ground. So that means Earth Power is going to start affecting us here. Is it going to start using Earth Power though? That's the question. Um, All right, we're going to go ahead and send out another poison jab. Try to get the poison, uh, try to get the poison hacks off on this thing. We do it land a crit, and it's got Hyper Voice. Okay, okay, Hyper Voice. That does a chonk, a very fat chonk bit right there. I don't like that, so I'm actually going to switch out um, Little Nikki for Daedra here. Of course, we need to see Arceus right now, right? Because why wouldn't we see Arceus, right? Right? Uh... Hyper Voice comes out, does nothing to Daedra whatsoever. The, the sunlight has faded, which is A-OK -okay by my standard. I'm going to start setting up the Toxic Spike here for whatever Pokemon comes out next from that side of the field. Wow, that Hyper Voice did a lot. Why? Why did that Hyper Voice do so much? Okay, Um. well, I don't love that, so we're going to use Strength against Arceus. It's going to use Hyper Voice again. Please don't knock out Danger. Please don't. Please don't. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're fine. All right, how much damage is this going to do? Not enough. Not enough. Okay, I'm going to have to switch out again. Again. Okay, um... All right, Treebeard. Treebeard, it is your time. Please do not use Earth Power. Treebeard, you are the legendary killer. Are you also the god killer out here? You use a hyper potion again. 
Yeah, I love to see that, folks. Um, okay, well, the only thing I really got for this Arceus is probably just to use low kick on it. Okay, Hyper Voice does not do a lot. We resist that. That's fine. Oh, we do over half damage to it. Okay, that's perfectly fine. We're going to do another low kick to it. Gravity's going to come out. Why? why? Why would you set up gravity when you can do Earth Power? Like, that, that only makes sense, right? Either way, this Arceus is finally up out of our face. Reptar... I'm so... Oh, my God. You got to be kidding me. How? How? All right. What's your last Pokemon? You got a Tortuga. Really? A Tortuga is your last Pokemon. Why do you insult me like this? Why do you insult me, Clement? Like, why? Why, why, why? All right. That doesn't do a lot. Obviously, it doesn't do a lot. <gasps> okay. 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 <laughs> oh, that did way more than I wanted it to. That did way more than I wanted to. Okay. Um... I don't like the position that we're in right now, so I'm going to send out Cinder to start laying waste to this Tortuga. Please don't use Brian again. That's all I can ask for. Please. All right, come on, Cinder. You can do the work here. You can do the work. Mold Breaker is uh, breaking the mold. We're going to do Brian onto our faces. How much does that do? Not a lot, so we're fine. Poison Damage is going to do a little bit more chip here, and we're probably going to be able to take it out with uh, one Dragon Rage. Dragon Rage, take it out from this health. Yeah, that should. That should. Okay, let's go ahead and Dragon Rage it. Just completely finish Clement off and get our next gym badge here. I cannot believe. I cannot believe we let Reptar go down there. Could I have done something different there? Yes, I could have. Did I realize that Arceus was going to use Punishment? No, I did not. I thought that was a move that it got later on, like level 50 or something like that. I did not realize that Arceus got Punishment that early on. If I had known that, I would not have set up. I would have got Reptar out of there immediately. And yeah, that wouldn't have happened. Um, but we do end up with TM24 Extreme Speed up in here. That's actually super sick. I think I was talking about that earlier with Zabuza. But I don't think Zabuza is going to be able to learn it, which really sucks. But let's see who can learn that real fast. Reptar could have learned extreme speed. <laughs> no. Either way, guys, if you did enjoy that episode of our randomizer Nuzlocke, make sure you hit that like button down below. And also make sure to leave a comment on what your favorite moment of this entire episode was. What's your uh, favorite moment of the entire lock so far? let me know in the comment section down below if you're not already subscribed to the channel and you did like the content over here or you want to see shiny reactions or any other contents uh, over here make sure to show that subscribe button a little bit of love too lets you know when i post videos so that way you always stay up to date either way definitely go ahead and check out that video right over there uh that's part the rest of the playlist and maybe you don't want to check out the rest of the playlist maybe you want to check out what youtube recommends to you either way stay happy healthy and hydrated and i cannot wait to see you in the next stream later